All right. Hey, guys, this is Bucky Helms with Web20Ranker.com. I am joined today by Lasha. He's our GMB team manager. Um, we're doing an employee spotlight. So welcome, Lasha. How are you? All is good here. Thank you, Bucky. How are you? Oh, pretty good. Pretty good. Just working, busy, you know. Yeah. I, I can't I can't complain, but it's always good to be busy. Yeah, I agree with you. So, guys, if you're watching this, obviously, Chaz usually does these. He's been traveling a lot lately, so, um, you know, hitting all the the different masterminds that he can hit and that sort of thing. So, I take, I'm take i taking over for that uh, maybe for a couple of months, and um, if he ever wants to step back in and do these, it's, you know, certainly up to him. But um, So, Lasha, tell me a little bit about yourself and, you know, how you got into SEO, that sort of thing, and we'll go from there. Oh, sure. I'm from Ukraine. Uh, what can I say about myself? <laughs> I started uh, learning SEO and PPC in uh, something like uh, 2015 or 16. We worked as freelancer for some time. Later, I joined the company in my city, uh, where I was uh, an, as an SEO and PPC specialist. Managed hundreds of PPC campaigns, did local SEO for US-based uh, companies. Uh, after that, um, I wanted to get uh, more experience, uh, experience to work with a big company. So I just uh, tried to search in Google and found Web20 Ranking. After that, I did some research on their website. I liked the services company was offering that I decided to ask uh, if they need me, the guy with this experience. After that, I was interviewed. Uh, we talked for about 20, 25 minutes, and in a few days, I received an offer from Chess. I was very pleased with this offer and was looking forward to starting my work in Web20 Ranker. This is it. Awesome, awesome. And that was, what, almost two years ago now, yeah? Uh, yes. Yeah, almost two years ago. Very cool. So when you first started at Web20, where, where did you start? I mean, obviously, we know you're GMB team manager now, but... Yeah, I started from the beginning. I started as a, a GMB optimization assistant, something like this. Gotcha. Cool. So actually working on the GMBs, optimizing, getting content, yep. setting up posts. Right. Yes. And then I, I think you quickly got into the role of kind of uh, team, uh, maybe not co-manager, assistant manager, maybe where you were working on all of the setups, kind of the most important part. And yeah, then, you know, managing clients and that sort of thing as well. Yes, that's right. After optimization, I started uh, with something like ordering tasks uh, for the campaigns and so on. Uh, and in, the, in a little bit, I started to do setups for campaigns. Awesome. Awesome. So I know, you know, just from talking with you and working with you in the company, you enjoy the position that you're in. But if you, if you could switch with any other person in the company and take their job, who would it be? Uh, sorry, I don't want to switch with anyone. <laughs> <laughs> I, feel, I, I feel had the maximum. same answer. <laughs> same answer. I don't want to switch. I like my job. Yeah, yeah. I feel maximum comfortable with my position, and uh, like I know that I am on my way, I, and I like this way. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's definitely a good spot, and you, you've done well with us. Um, I mean, I, you know, we we work and almost talk every single day, just via chat. Obviously, we're on different sides of the world, but. You're always that, you know, good go-getter. We know if we have an issue or a problem or whatever, I'm just like, I'm just going to hit Lasha up. He'll know how to fix it. He'll be able to fix it. Thank you. Um, so we definitely appreciate that. Let's see. Um, da, da, da. Which one was it? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hobbies. So you put on here that you would become a side trance DJ. Yeah. <laughs> tell me uh, tell me about i actually used to dj so that kind of interests me as well uh you know uh sometimes uh we all have to do something uh, really boring boring work this is something like i need to uh do a lot of copy and pass something like that mm -hmm. you know it, it, it's sometimes it's driving, driving you crazy and you want to sleep or something like that and uh if you will turn on side trans music <laughs> it will like push you up and you're like, okay, let's do it. Come on. <laughs> it really helps sometimes. So I guess 
uh, th this is my second favorite job. It would be my second favorite job, Cytrans DJ. <laughs> awesome, awesome. Well, cool, cool. So um, let's see. We'll just do a couple more, and then uh, sure. and then we'll kind of log off. But um, what about hobbies? Any? What do you do in your free time? Uh, almost all my free time is spent with my family. Uh, I have a, a four years old son and he needs my attention. Uh, I, I need uh, his attention. <laughs> uh, yeah. I, I, you understand what I'm talking about? Yeah. <laughs> but, oh, for sure. uh, but if I have like little more time, I try to read a lot. Uh, history, psychology, philosophy, something that will help me, help me to understand uh, human something that will help me to understand society because this is something that uh, uh, we for sure need in our industry so what are you reading right now or what what's the last thing that you read as far as any of that goes okay uh, last thing is uh, 33 rules of the war uh, by robert green very very cool book okay i'm actually going to type that right here so i can so 33 Rules of the war. Rules of the world. I want to look that up. I'm always down for uh, some really in-depth reading for sure. I don't. I, I can get into fiction, but it's got to be something like really well written. It's got to be a really cool story. It's got to be engaging. But if it's not a fiction, then I'm the same. Like something like history, yeah. philosophy. Yeah. You know, that's that's when I have time. Obviously, we both work a lot, but yeah. you know, it's good to make time for hobbies. Good to make time for stuff like that. So, um, here was another one that was good that I liked. It says, uh, "If you could learn to do anything, what would it be?" And you said, "I would love to study history, philosophy, psychology. Yeah. Yeah. All these help to understand the person and society. This is necessary for my industry." So absolutely, in the, in the marketing industry and helping agencies, you know, learn their avatar and behavior and search behavior, coming up with search intent from just an agency gives you one keyword and you're looking yeah, for long yeah. tails. And exactly, yeah. I love it. I love it. Well, uh, did you have anything that you wanted to add or? Uh, what I can add. Uh... I really like what I'm doing here in Web20 Ranker. I like Web20 Ranker. Uh, I remember uh, maybe a year ago, uh, some, somebody told that uh, in few years, Web20 Ranker will be like uh, the best white label company. Uh, and I believe Web20 will be the best white label company. That's why I'm here. That's why I will do everything from my side to help the company. Uh, to succeed awesome well i will definitely uh, agree with you on that one that's why i'm i'm on board as well i saw a good thing you know two it's almost two two years and three months or so is when i started but i used web 20 before for mm. my agency and you know my outsourcing um and then got into the groups of course with uh local client takeover group met Chaz in there met mark in there reached out to them and just the people that you know work in the company that i started talking with and chatting with and that sort of thing they're very you know humble down to earth hard workers they care about their clients they care about you know the agencies that work with us and it's you know it's a it's a good company to work with and we've grown so much and it's thanks to you know people like you in the company that actually care about it that we're actually able to grow because without fulfillment without good team managers without somebody that cares about the setups on one of our flagship products, we wouldn't be where we are today. We certainly wouldn't be growing as much as we have over the past two years. So I agree with you wholeheartedly. I think that's pretty good. Uh, employee Spotlight of the Month, Lasha, GMB team manager. Thanks okay. for joining. And uh, I'm sure we'll see each other in chat over the next couple of hours if you're still working. <laughs> yeah, still working. <laughs> right. All right. Well, thanks so much. And guys, you know, obviously you can check out the employee spotlight. We've already posted um, his, you know, question and answers things. It's on social. We'll post this video with it again. We'll, you know, reshow that. Um, but I think the next one that's coming up is uh, I think Alvin. So we'll get to, we'll get to chat with Alvin as well, but Lasha, thanks so much. And uh, I'll see you later. 
Thank you, Baki, so much. Bye. All right. Thanks, guys.